Bia Guru Prasad, what I want to know from you is the challenges that uh, the two astronauts, Sunita Williams and Butch, Butch Wilmer, will be facing once they land on Earth, once the splashdown is completed. Uh, good evening. Uh, see, uh, these kind of challenges will be there for any astronaut uh, uh, or a cosmonaut or a taikonaut that is a space traveler. Because, you know, Sunita Williams has uh, stayed in space for nine months. Definitely some uh, changes would have occurred in the body. Okay. Definitely these are normal uh, for an astronaut. Uh, that's why they have, when they undertake these things, they know very well. And uh, uh, the thing is, the first what uh, they do is, once the landing is completed, they are going to take the spacecraft to, uh, uh, um, they are going to high street on a ship. Then hatches will be opened, they will come out and they will be taken to the Johnson Space Center. That is where the human space flight uh, uh, related activities are directed uh, 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 on behalf of NASA. So they will be taken there. They will be, they will undergo thorough medical tests to assess their physiological condition and uh, following which they will be thoroughly debriefed. It is not only the status of the bodies, but their experience, how they experienced it uh, and uh, such things. Uh, uh, they, they will be assessed through the thorough debrief, uh, debriefing uh, and this will be followed by whatever therapy kind of thing. Therapy is too big a word. What are all the procedures to be followed to make them to adapt uh, back to uh, the uh, uh, terrestrial environment that is the kind of life which they led before they went to space. So all these things are very have very well established procedures and these are quite normal. Talking about procedures, uh, what do you think are the post splashdown protocols that the team will have to follow? Protocols in the sense, you know, there was a time when uh, there used to be a big quarantine during the Apollo era and such things for three weeks. They were quarantined, thinking that uh, some germs they might have brought from the moon and all those things. And uh, even there, after one or two Apollo uh, missions, they discontinued that. And this kind of uh, uh, threat or this kind of, uh, uh, what can I say, uh, suspecting things are not there. So, uh, probably uh, they will be able to uh, uh, reunite with their families at the earliest. Of course, after following uh, certain procedures. But anyway, as I told you, you know, first thing is as soon as they land, they are going to assess their health thoroughly, different uh, systems of the body. Absolutely. We are Guru Prasad. On that note, thank you very much for speaking to Republic and joining us here on the broadcast. India awaits the historic homecoming of Sunita Williams. And it is going to take place at 2.15 a.m. tonight. Republic is going to be live on that.